Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave birth to time and space. Once there was an explosion, a bang which set a planet spinning in that space. Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion.
I think they're gone. <laughs> what the hell? Didn't mean to grab you so hard. Tears. A chiral allergy. So, you have dooms, like me. I've got the extinction factor, but I think you got me beat. What's your level? You can see them, right? No, but I can sense them. Level two, then. What are you doing here? Trying to stay dry. Same as you. Time falls let up. My name is Fragile. Yeah, I've heard of you. <laughs> that right? Sam Porter Bridges. The man who delivers. For me? Must be tough out here on your own. Yeah, I thought Fragile Express had plenty of people. Plenty of traitors. Not much left of us now, save for a few honest folks. And on top of that, not much left of me either. Got soaked from neck to toe. I can't help you with that. I make deliveries, that's all. Central Dispatch, Freelance Contractor, Sam Porter Bridges, Receiver standing by for drop. Headed into town. Watch yourself. Those things never stay gone for long. Time for fast forwards, whatever it touches. But it can't wash everything away. The past just won't let go. I'll see you around. Sam Porter Bridges.
What took you so long? It's not like the legend to come in late. Had to wait out the storm. Lost my bike. Sounds like you've been through the ringer. Luckily, our goods are in perfect condition. Well, 
you did keep us waiting, but everything else seems to be in perfect order, so great work. We'll be awaiting the next delivery. Igor, Bridges' corpse disposal. Sam Porter, I presume? Right. Not the touchy-feely type. Takabe said you had some kind of phobia. Bridges' corpse disposal? What happened? Look, gotta get a move on. I'll explain as we go. Come on. Come and take a look. He's got a date with the incinerator. How long since he flatlined? We don't know the exact TOD, but I'd say it's been upwards of 40 hours. He wasn't quarantined. Not sick. This is a suicide. Oh, Jesus. We're just lucky we found him at all. Got him on ice ASAP, but who knows when he'll go necro. Where are you taking him? Uh, closest incinerators to the north. This route's crawling with BTs. Sure you can't use another? I wish I could, but there's no time. Then just burn the poor bastard right here. You put all that chirillum in the air so close to town? Can't do it. Better that than trying for the incinerator. Hey, we can do this. We just need someone like you with dooms. Well, he's already in the first stages of necrosis. If we don't hurry, this place is a crater. So how about it? Can we count on you? Then Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Sam. Just Sam. And I can't spot BTs. Just sense them. That's why we came prepared. A bridge baby, huh? With its help and you, we'll be able to stay one step ahead of them. Makes me feel like shit every time. Well, you are plugging into the other side. Freaks me out, too. Roll out!
Well, the world was different when I was a kid. America is a country. Anybody could go anywhere they damn well pleased. No need for couriers like yourself. We have highways, airplanes, we can even visit other countries. Hard to imagine it now. As you can see, the Death Stranding poked us full of holes. Fucked us beyond all recognition. And if you were lucky enough to survive, the Timefall came and washed you away. Then those freaks from the beach showed up. The worlds of the living and the dead all mixed together. And that's when folks started pulling up in the cities. Couriers like yourself put up on a pedestal. Son of a bitch. Rainbow! How much further to the incinerator? This guy's about to pop. Shit. We're gonna have to cut to the BTs. or something.
BB. BB, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Steady. Once there was an explosion, a bang which gave rise to life as we know it. And then came the next explosion. An explosion that will be our last. How does it feel to be back in the world of the living? Don't worry. I'm a doctor. Well, a coroner, originally. Call me Dead Man. I'm well acquainted with the dead. Not like you, of course. Contrary to the name, I've never actually died. I would advise against that. I'm no expert, but I can assure you it's for your own protection. See? So I'm a prisoner. These aren't handcuffs. They're cutting-edge devices that keep us all connected. Us? Oh, us. Yup. Bridges. Humanity's best hope for the future. Or avoiding extinction, if you prefer. Right. Where am I? What time is it? Watch me. Try pressing it against your skin, like this. Relax. That just means your body's got a good connection to the cufflink. Look, look. Cuffs will watch over you 24 hours a day. That is to say, we will. We're here to help. What the hell? Two days. During that time, we took the liberty of collecting fluid samples from you. You're a repatriate. That makes you very special. What happened to the CD guys? 
Central Knot was obliterated in the Annihilation. Game over, man. Place is a crater. The only ones to get it continue were you, for obvious reasons, and your broken bridge baby. Is it all right? Uh, it's been marked for disposal. Didn't work anymore. Why keep it? Uh, we lost everyone. Not just corpse disposal. My team, HQ, all of Redford, every soul in Central Knot City. We're at our base, in Capital Knot City now. Or should I say, our new headquarters. Sudbury seemed the logical choice. But our implementation team has been decimated. And there's only so much they can do in two days. Things here are a mess. Fortunately, the director and his support team were out of town at the time, so the chain of command remains intact. I hate to do this so soon, but I have a job for you. Huh. Uh, uh, this stencil is from when you repatriated? Uh, what's the other mark from? A clinging woman in a cave. <gasps> hmm. I see. Aphenphosmphobia. No wonder you were out there alone, where no one could touch you. I'll try to be more careful, Sam. So, uh, the job is an urgent delivery. I need you to bring the president some morphine. What president? America's gone. You talking about the mayor of Central Knot? No, 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 no. Not the mayor. America lives on, Sam. The president is in the final stages of cancer, in critical condition, but there's still time. Why me? Look, Sam, do as I ask, and I promise it will all make sense. Why don't you do it? Because I'm not really here. Apologies. This is just a chirogram. And here oh, come the tears. Allergic reaction to the chiral transmission. I'm actually over in the isolation ward in the big triangle building. Ah, here is the morphine. Bridges hereby enters into a contract with Sam Porter. Come on, you got morphine there. What's this about? Tell me the truth. The truth, Sam, is that America's last president wants to see you in person. Are you really about to say no? Very good. I'll see you in the isolation ward. ID. Verifying ID. Clear. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Delivery order for Sam Porter Bridges. Request transport of morphine to isolation ward for immediate administration to the president.
Dan. Have a pleasant journey. Check the map on your cufflinks if you're lost, Sam. The isolation word should be pretty obvious. If you're not sure how to get there, you can set markers and draw routes, too. Try it out and you'll see what I mean. Hello! steer you wrong. Uh, provided you have a destination, that is. Constructionist movement. If the president hadn't required special treatment, she would have never left. And if she hadn't, we wouldn't have either. signs are all trending the same way. No chance of a recovery, then? None that I can see. No. We should start making preparations. Sam! It's me. Dead man. Sorry. My mistake. I'm afraid the President's condition has deteriorated. Thank you. This will help to ease the pain. And allow her to speak with you in these final moments. Her? Huh? The first and last female president of the United States. Surely you remember her. She raised you? You're not exactly dressed for a reunion. Take that off before you come inside.
That's the president's right-hand man, the director of bridges. Die hard, man. Oh, you were with Bridges One? So, I guess no introductions are necessary. What's it been, Sam? Ten years? Look at us. A bunch of deathless freaks meeting like this. Yeah, well... Good to see you two. President's waiting. It's your mother, Bridget. She's a bit out of it, but I know she'll recognize you. Madam President, we've brought Sam. <sighs> we'll leave you two alone. her three years to cross. She's trying to rebuild the country. Still going on about that, huh? You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. Help Amelie. She needs you. <laughs> Together, you you can help us reconnect. You can make America whole. Sam, if we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. We don't need a country. Not anymore. We do. Alone, we have no future. No, America's finished. Bridget, you're the president of Jack shit. Sam, listen to me. <clears throat> Let, you, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. <gasps> Madam President! Oh, no. Doctor, we need your help. Okay, with me. Madam President. 
Listen, no one can know that the president is dead. If word gets out, Bridges is finished. Now what happened here does not leave this room, do you understand? Yes, Director, but there's still the matter of the body. Without corpse disposal. We've got that covered. Sam, before she died, the president made a contract with you. What are you talking about? As a member of Bridges, you're gonna work with the rest of us to rebuild America. You think you can recruit me? Like she tried to? Well, she succeeded. Look at your wrist. If that's not symbolic, I don't know what is. Director, the cancer spread throughout her entire body. Harvesting organs is out of the question. And there is no need for an autopsy. Her body needs to be cremated before she necrotizes. And if we don't, this place will turn into another crater. What do you want me to do? We don't have any porters right now. And the CD team you went into the field with are dead. But the President's body has to be burned. The road from Capital Knot City to the incinerator was compromised in the void out. Now, the only way there is on foot, through the mountains. But the chiral density there is off the chart. It's gotta be BTs. This job has requirements. Tombs. Repatriate. So me? Why? Sam, you're already on the clock. Now get it done, Sam Porter Bridges. President Strand believed in American Reconstructionism. She worked tirelessly to bring the nation together again. And without her, there would be no bridges. She deserves a funeral with full honors. But we can't give her that. If she dies, America dies. Without her, bridges will cease to be. Listen. Her cremation must be carried out with the utmost secrecy. Even if we pull it off, what then? Who's gonna take her place? Face it, America's history. Sam, America isn't dead yet. He just said that it dies if Bridget dies. She may be lost to us, but we still have an America worthy of the presidency. Sorry, what? Let's not get into it now. What matters is that we're going to finish your mother's work and rebuild America as she intended. That's the reason Bridges exists. So take the first step, Sam, and deliver the president's body to the incinerator. If we don't all come together again, humanity will not survive. 
You're the one I wanted to send, Sam. Time's running out. I love you, Sam. I'll be waiting for you on the beach. Facilities to the southwest. Remember that you'll be passing through BT territory. We built the incinerator way up in the mountains so that the chiral matter in the smoke wouldn't reach the city. It won't be easy carrying a body up there. We'll be monitoring you around the clock. If anything comes up, we'll offer you support via the cufflinks. incinerator will be anything but easy. Move around and change the angle of your map to gain a better understanding of the terrain. See if you can't pick a path to your destination. For this order, we've provided you with a number of suggested routes as well. Ultimately, though, it's up to you to decide how you want to proceed. I don't think I need to remind you, but every minute counts when transporting corpses for disposal. 48 hours following cardiac arrest, they go necro and become a fresh BT to make our lives hell.
area is climbing rapidly. Heavy timefall is imminent. Get back here, now. Sam, burn the other cargo while you're there. What's this? BB-28. It's the unit Igor was assigned. It was hooked up to you when we found you in the crater. But why is it here? Because it's flagged for disposal. Central Knot's gone, and our headquarters along with it. Because that thing didn't do its job. It's all in Igor's logs. But it's still alive. It can't be repaired. And it can't survive outside the pod. Pity it if you want. But the decision has been made. It has to go. The director approved the order. Listen up, Sam. The terminals Amelie's people built in the towns and cities they pass through on their journey west are called knots. The infrastructure's there, but the Cairo network is offline. Right now, it's only capable of transmitting voice communications. Sometimes wired, sometimes wireless, and a small amount of data. So, unless the necessary data stored on site, our chirograms won't show up. 
Emily and the other Bridges members you've seen around the place are grams generated with local data. In case you didn't know. Anyway, all you've got to do is find the knot, connect your Cupid, and bring Cairo Communications online. Once you connect it to the terminal, you'll be able to initiate zero-time massive data transmission with the UCA network. And just like that, you'll reconnect us not only to each other, but to our past. All the lost and fragmented junk data will be compiled and restored. Like bringing a dinosaur back to life from a fossil. Four point six billion years of history on Earth. All the wisdom and knowledge we lost since the Death Stranding will be ours again. And that, my friend, is how we'll beat this thing. Once you establish Cairo Communications, generating grams won't be an issue. You'll also be able to use Cairo printers. It won't be long before we're able to send all kinds of things through the wire. Except anything original. Or that's got a soul. Nothing real. Just copies. True. Which is why we'll still need porters like you. Before and after we're made whole, we'll need men in the middle. No rest for the wicked, huh? Yeah, well, idle hands and all that. We'll give you the details at the dispatch terminal. Make sure you check it upstairs. Drop's waiting up there, too. These shoes look like they've done some serious miles. Shall I dispose of them? Wait. Hold on. There's something I want you to look into. My blood seemed to set those things off. Happened more than once. Set them off? How do you mean? I don't know. You took my blood, didn't you? You tell me. All right. I'll see what I can do. Hmm. Okay. 